guys, it's the game, Marcos L. Welcome to another exciting episode of Friday Night Freddy's. This is the show where I showcase my uh, homemade NAF creations from the nightmares to the sister location alongside some other cool uh, ideas like video games and uh, cartoon shows and stuff like that. And they all fight against each other. So if you guys are just tuning in, that's what this show is about here. But uh, anyway, so let's talk about the matches that we're having today. Oh! Before we get into that, I just want to mention, I did an About Me video, so if you guys want to learn a little bit more about this channel, there's going to be a little card link that you can follow after the video is all done playing. So check that out, it's a good video. It was like uh, I did my first vlog, so go check out my vlog, make sure you guys drop a like on it if you enjoyed the vlog. Anyways, uh, so the matches tonight, we're going to have a rematch of Monday Night Mayhem. We're going to have Ennard taking on Balloon Boy, they're going to go head to head one more time, because it was such a popular match, I thought you guys with like a part two, I did some updating to Balloon Boy, so you guys will get to see that. And then in the main event, we're going to have the tag team titles on the line. It's going to be Toys 2 team of Toy Chica and Toy Bonnie versus Springtrap and Nightmare Bonnie. So the titles are going to be up for grabs tonight. I'm excited for that match. Let's head down to the ring and let's get started. If you guys missed Monday Night Mayhem, we had an exciting match. We had Balloon Boy make his debut in singles competition, and he went up against the former Golden Freddy champion, Ennard. And he came out mocking Ennard. Um, he eliminated him from the Jump Scare Royal Rumble a couple weeks ago. So, uh, Ennard kind of <laughs> laid the beat down on Balloon Boy, but Balloon Boy has requested this rematch, and I think he might have a bit of a suicide wish. You gotta wonder what his motivation is wanting to lock horns again with Ennard. I'm a little bit baffled by the situation, but uh, hey, maybe Balloon Boy knows something that we don't. If you guys want to see that match, make sure you check out the link in the description. There will be a link to Monday Night Mayhem if you'd like to see their first encounter in a one-on-one -on -one match. And there's the new and improved version of Balloon Boy. I did some work on the face. I changed the hat. I added some stuff uh, to the face. Gave him hair. I didn't make the original design. That was from Godzilla, though. And the opponent. He is a former Golden Freddy champion. He was the flagship character of this show for a while. And he just recently was successful in singles competition against Balloon Boy last week. Well, I should say on Monday, not exactly a week ago. He is the endoskeleton. It doesn't look like he's coming out in jump scare mode today. It seems like Ennard has uh, toned it down a bit, as they say, seeing as how he's not coming out here in, uh, in destroy everything mode, apparently. How about that brutal assault after the match? And if you guys are enjoying this song, make sure you guys subscribe to CG5. He was kind enough to let me use his music for this specific entrance. So, uh, shout out to CG5. Hope you're doing well. I see your subscriber count is growing exponentially. But, uh, you know, every little bit of support helps, so I hope that you get a couple subscribers from my channel over on your end. If you guys subscribe to CG5, tell them the game MLL sent you. And that you subscribed, obviously. And, like I said, you gotta wonder what Balloon Boy mentality is going into this match. Why would you want to rematch against this beast of a creation of Ennard? And he looks poised. He looks ready for action. <laughs> you 
you don't know what they've been through. He's also the boss from the sister location, Five Nights at Freddy's game. If you guys have never seen that or something, I recommend checking it out. It's pretty, pretty mysterious. Looks like they're working on FNAF 6 already. So I'm excited for that. There will be other creations. Either the Twisted Ones or FNAF 6 creations coming to this game in 2K18 last year. I know I've been kind of going on and on about the Twisted Ones, but I haven't found much official art for the Twisted Ones. So if worse comes to worse, we will be doing... Uh, FNAF 6 characters on 2K18 next year, but you can guarantee that we will have the Nightmare and the Sister Location characters available also. And Balloon Boy, gearing up. Ennard looks pumped. The flying cross body to Balloon Boy. Ennard wiping him off his feet there. Oh, and he scores with that hook super kick. But took Balloon Boy's head off. Vicious T-Bone suplex. Hurling Balloon Boy across the ring. Oh, and a big knee strike to the face. He is just taking Balloon Boy to school. And Balloon Boy, I have a feeling this is going to be another short-lived beatdown of a match. Courtesy of Ennard. Hope you guys are having a good weekend. If you guys are watching this, it's probably Friday or Saturday, depending on what time zone you're in. But in the States here, it should be Friday. Wait a second, Balloon Boy clamps on the submission hold. Ennard's in a bit of trouble here. Wait a second, he reverses the momentum. and catches uh, Balloon Boy with a kick to the, to the face. Straight to the face. And not even a two count. Ennard has it clamped on. He's got the Ennard Con device. Let's go. Already Ennard is looking to end this thing. He's trying to hook him up into the sister location's kiss. And he's coiled. He's poised. Boom! Sister Location's Kiss. Wait a second, who's that running down to the ring? Whoa, he has him tied up in the ropes. Oh, what a hot shot. Yendo is heading back to the locker room. Bloom Boy recovers. Rolls through, wait a second. Not this way. No. And Balloon Boy is defeated Ennard for a second time. I I don't even know what to say to that. I am I am shocked that anybody would want to come help Balloon Boy. Let alone make enemies with Ennard. But they those two have fought in the past before. So I guess it was only a matter of time. And Balloon Boy. There he goes again, mocking Ennard. Well, you guys voted for him to move to the Jump Scare Division, so that's where he's going. But wow, what a win to take with him to the Jump Scare Division. I can't believe Yendo went down there, grabbed Ennard's foot, and cost him the match. Who'd have thunk it? Balloon Boy pulling up a win. So, um, I'm gonna put another poll in the video. You guys think that he should stay, uh, in the Heavyweights Division, or do you think he should go down to the Jump Scare Division? Let me know by voting in the poll. Alright guys, so let's head over to the main event. It's going to be the tag team titles on the line. It's going to be Toys 2 Team versus Springtrap and Nightmare Bonnie. Yeah! Alright guys, it's main event time. So here is first introducing the challengers for the Tag Team Championship. Please welcome Springtrap and Nightmare Bonnie. They look pumped. They look ready for action. I'm curious as to why Plush Trap is not accompanying them to the ring though. Oh, 
Alright, and here they are. Wait a second, here comes... Here comes Toy Chica and Toy Bon... This is a big stomp to the, uh, to the stomach of Spring... Excuse me, this big stomp to the stomach of, uh, Bonnie. And Springtrap is just getting clobbered by Chica. Sorry about that, that kind of caught me by surprise. I wasn't expecting them to come out there and, uh, just start attacking them during their entrance. There's a go behind from Springtrap. Oh! And the official needs to gain control of this match. And there goes Springtrap over the top ropes. And we gotta restore order here, this is chaotic. And it looks like we've got things back on track. The match has officially begun, after all that. Ties him up. Boom! Big elbow to the arm. And Chica telling him exactly how she feels about the fans here. Is this a possible heel turn from the Toys 2 team? It's a big reverse DDT on the back of Chica's head. And she's probably seeing stars right about now. It's a big elbow into the sternum. Off the ropes. Chica down. Chica's up. And he counters with the jawbreaker. It's a fireman's carry from Chica. Off the ropes. And they collide. But it was enough to stop him. Oh, there's a neck crank hip toss there. Some stiff jabs from Bonnie. There's a kick to the calf. And Bonnie tags himself in. Now we have a Bonnie versus Bonnie situation going on here. Toy Bonnie drops him with the pendulum backbreaker. Toy Chica. I don't think she was aware that uh, Bonnie tagged himself in. She is now out on the apron. And he scores with the boot. I thought he was going to be in a, uh, in a tag team move there for a second. There's the Scott press, the forearm shots to the face. And he's just stomping that rabbit mud hole in him and walking him dry here. Boom, scores with the elbow. And Bonnie, he's got his back against the wall as they say. Stuck in the Toys 2 corner. It's a double arm ringer. Shoulder block. Make a wish. Toy Bonnie back out on the apron. Oh my god, Chica scores with the Pele kick. It's about uh, rung his bell there. Oh, and there's a Chica kick for good measure. Could be lights out. One, two, and Nightmare Bonnie able to just barely get the shoulder up this early on in the match. And uh, he really needs to get over there and tag Springtrap. Priority. Again with the DDT. Chica just not giving him an inch of wiggle room here. What's Chica got set up here? Oh, there he goes over the top ropes. Wait a second, Chica. Tope Suicida Chica dive. Holy smokes, I've never seen her do that before. Apparently that chicken can fly. Body tossed unceremoniously back into the ring. Springtrap needs to make the save here. One, two. Ooh, that was a close one. Like I said before, these guys are doing a good job of cutting the ring in half. Bonnie is not able to make it over to Springtrap. This match could be over sooner than later. There's a rabbit flip. Oh, and he avoids the contact with Toy Bonnie. It's a bridging German suplex. One. Oh, and there's a big shot to the sternum by Springtrap to Toy Chica. 
Twitchika taking exception to Springtrap's interference. Boom! What's Chica doing with Springtrap? Springtrap isn't even the legal man in this match. Looks like they're doing some sort of a tandem offense. There's a key lock. Trades off with Bonnie. Wait a second! Oh, deep six! Out of nowhere! Referee goes for the cover. One, two, and Bonnie just barely getting saved from Toy Chica. He set him up. There's the end of days. Oh, wait a second. Judo throw. Good counter from Toy Bonnie. Toy Bonnie was in a world of trouble there for a second. And he scores with the pendulum backbreaker. It's a big uppercut. It's usually the precursor to the combo. Boom! Oh, and he just busted him open. Nightmare Body isn't going to be able to see straight after that one. Wait a second. Up to the top ropes. Chica's going to fly again. Chicken foot right to the heart of uh, Body. Just rolls over Nightmare Bonnie. To a Chica go for the cover. One, two. Oh, and Springtrap able to make the save. Luckily for Nightmare Bonnie or else that would have been it. Oh, and there's a big clothesline. Nightmare Bonnie going for the submission hold here. There's a stump puller. Toy Chica finds a way to escape. Rolls through. Looks up with the T-Bone. Big power slam from Nightmare Bonnie. Nightmare Bonnie desperately needs to make a tag here. And there he goes. Switches out for Springtrap. Chica uh, oblivious to the fact that they've tagged. Springtrap, Irish whip into the turnbuckles. Chica's going up top. What's Springtrap doing here? The sidewalk slam! Oh, all the way off the top ropes. And Chica, starting to be in uh, the hot seat here, needs to get the tag over to her partner. And she just barely recovers. Oh, and I think that was the window of opportunity she was looking for. There's a tag to Bonnie. Bonnie is the fresher of the two. There's some good tandem offense there. Looks like Bonnie might be teaching Chica some of those one-two punches. And Springtrap grabs him by the arm. He suckered him in. Turns the table. Again with the arm drag. Keylock DDT. The most electrifying move in animatronics entertainment, the spring trap. Back sweep kick. One, two. Oh, and he kicks out. Well, it's the self-professed most electrifying move according to spring trap. I don't know, I believe that's debatable. And there's a big bulldog from Bonnie. Springtrap gets whipped into his own corner. Bonnie tags himself in. I don't know how smart that was. Oh, and he steps over and comes back with a heel kick right in the face of Nightmare Bonnie. That was some serious hang time there with that springboard in Sigiri. It's a jawbreaker. Scores with the DDT. I'm at body line motionless here. I'm at Bonnie. Oh, I'm at Bonnie recovered first. Looked like he's playing possum. Tags in Springtrap. Springtrap set up something. Oh, big kick into the buckle bomb. Good night. And he might be setting up that loaded spring shot. It's got him pivoted towards the ropes. Oh, he could have broke Toy Bonnie's neck. Goes for the cover. We might have new tag team champions. Oh. Kicks out at a uh, one count, surprisingly. 
she could easily get over there and help. Oh, and she goes sailing over Springtrap, catches him with the crossbody. Looked like more of a forearm shark than a crossbody, but uh, she got all of it. And Springtrap. Million dollar fist drop, courtesy of Toy Bonnie. Goes for the cover. One, two, and he just barely gets the shoulder up. Oh, he rolls through. And there's a brain buster from Springtrap. It's about scrambling Bonnie's brains there. Toy Bonnie. I think Toy Bonnie might need to make a tag now. Chica's had plenty of time to rest. Meanwhile, he's been absorbing a lot of the abuse. Wait a second. Hot shot. And Springtrap whipped into the corner. Here comes Toy Chica. What are they setting up here? Oh, there's a big splash. The champions! Oh, the tandem offense. Nice stomped off of his own partner. Off of Toy Chica's own partner. Wake up, referee! One, two, and Springtrap barely getting the shoulder up. It's a big kick to the spine. He blocks. Toy Chica answers back. Celebrating a little bit too early, in my opinion. Toy Bonnie. Oh, did you see that? He just rolled off Springtrap's head there. Looks like Springtrap might be setting up something big. Oh, he just crushed Toy Chica's skull right under his knee. And Toy Bonnie needs to get in there and help his partner. Might be seeing another spring shot. Oh, he could have broke Chica's arm that time. Toy Bonnie. Going for the save. Clobber's the official. Toy Chica rolls out of the way. Toy Chica. Oh! Behind the referee's back. Assaulting Springtrap with a steel chair. And what has gotten into the Toys 2 team? This is not like them to take advantage of uh, the referee being incapacitated. Attacking the other team before the match even begins. Something's going Chica slides in. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Oh, the spring the spring trap flapjack. One, two, three. And we have new tag team champions. Let's take a look at some of those sweet replays. There you see Bonnie escaping. It's a near fall. I think uh, Springtrap. Nope, Springtrap didn't make the save there. There's the Suicida. Uh, excuse me, Chilpe Suicida Chica dive. And there you see the rolling spring uh, Springtrap flapjack. We gotta think of a better name than that. Help me out here, guys. And he, uh... How about the spring lock? We'll call that move the spring lock. That sounds better. I'm just making this up on the fly, in case you didn't notice. Um, but anyways, we have new tag team champions. <laughs> so Nightmare, Bonnie, and Springtrap bringing home the gold. Here are your winners and the new Friday Night Freddy's Tag Team Champions. Springtrap and Nightmare Bonnie. We have new Friday Night Freddy's Tag Team Champions. You guys saw it here. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. Don't forget to drop a like. Um, share this uh, video with your friends by dropping a like. It'll help my channel grow a little bit better. But uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. I'm the game, Marco L, a.k.a. the game MLL, signing out. And you guys have a good rest of your weekend. Don't forget to check out my live stream of um, Dead by Daylight. It's going to be airing sometime today. Hope to see you guys there. It'll be my first playthrough of it. 
So anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.